Hello, and welcome to my channel. Today, we're going to be talking about how to configure an HID multi technology card reader using the HID Reader Manager application. HID multi technology card readers are popular in many industries because they support multiple types of credentials, including proximity cards, smart cards, and even mobile devices. Without any further ado, let's start the video. Before we get started, Please note that you'll need to have the HID Reader Manager application installed on your device. You can download it from the Play Store by searching for HID Reader Manager and installing the app from the Google Play Store or iPhone App Store. Once you've downloaded and installed the app, let's start with the first time setup process. Upon opening the app for the first time, you'll need to accept the terms and conditions by clicking on the Agree button. Next, you'll be prompted to register by entering your email address and clicking Submit. Then, you'll see the license page, and after reading the terms, you'll need to click on Agree. This will open the registration form, where you need to fill out your application details such as email address, password, and confirm password, etc. Once you've filled out all the fields, click on Register. A pop-up message will appear on the screen, indicating that the registration was successful, and you'll receive an email at your registered email address to activate your account. Now, let's open the email, and click on the link to activate the HID Reader Manager account. As you can see, I received an email regarding the activation of my account. Click on the given link to activate your HID Manager account. Once you click on the link, you'll be redirected to a screen confirming that your account has been activated successfully. Let's go back to the HID Reader Manager application and log in using the login credentials we just registered and activated. Once you log in into the application, this will bring us to the dashboard where we can start configuring our HID multi-technology card reader. I want to inform you that after registering your account in the HID Reader Manager application portal, you won't be able to configure the readers unless you have a valid authentication key from HID Global. HID Reader Manager uses key authorization to securely connect and control access by the mobile app to HID Signal readers. The HID I Class SE Express R10 reader and HID I Class SE Multi Class SE readers using either of two key set types. Mobile, MOB key, issued for HID Mobile Access Credentials only. And HID Elite, ICE key, issued for HID Elite Physical and or HID Mobile Access Credentials. These keys ensure that only matching secure pairs will communicate with each other, and they're specific to each individual customer. You can obtain these keys by sending an email to HID Global, Customer Center. Once you receive the authentication key, Go to the home screen of the HID Reader Manager application and tap the settings icon. Then, click on Enter Invitation Code and enter the invitation code which you received from the HID. Then tap on Register Device. If the invitation code was valid, and entered correctly, an invitation code was successfully accepted. Message will display. Tap on X to close. Once the account registration and authentication process is complete, you can begin configuring your reader. To do this, return to the home screen of the HID Reader Manager application. To configure a card reader, you need to connect that particular reader with the application. To do this, click on Scan for Reader. Once you click on this option, the application will start scanning for readers that are within range of your mobile device. Make sure the reader is powered on and has a signal strength value. 
values closer to 0 dBm typically indicate that a reader is physically closest. For example, a signal strength of minus 50 dBm typically indicates that a reader is physically closer than a reader with a signal strength of minus 100 dBm. Once a reader has been found, click on the reader to see two options, inspect or locate. Click on locate to confirm the physical reader you want to configure. When you click on locate, the reader will start beeping for 8 seconds. This will help you identify the physical reader you want to configure. Once the beep finishes, and you confirm the physical reader you want to configure, click on inspect. It will take a few seconds to complete the process, and get to the reader configuration menu. Here, you will need to configure the templates. Templates store reader configuration settings. When a template is created, it can be applied to multiple readers of the same model that require the same configuration, or shared with other technicians to speed up reader configuration. To create a new template, go to the home screen, and tap on the templates icon. Then, on the templates screen, tap the plus icon. This will open the build template screen, where you can configure, and add settings to your template. Remember, templates only need to include the reader settings that are applicable to the selected reader type. From the Credential Details section, tap Keys. In the Keys section, tap Add Keys. Authorized keys are displayed on the screen. Select an authorization key to load onto the reader, only one key can be loaded. Tap Add to the template to save. Next, from the Credential Details section, tap on Credentials. Select the desired HID Mobile Access option, NFC and, or BLE, and then Enable or disable the required credential types. The list of displayed credential options depends on the selected credential profile. Once you have completed the settings, click on Add to the template. When all the necessary configuration settings are selected and added to the template, tap on Save as Template. Then, tap in the Category area and select a category from the displayed list or add a new category. Then tap in the title area and enter a title for the template. Finally, tap on Save Template. Your new template is now displayed on the template screen, with indicators for the configuration types within the template. You can share this template with other reader technicians to speed up the configuration of multiple readers. To apply the template, simply tap on the created template, and you will have the option to view and apply it. Click on View to review your template and click on apply to apply the template. Once you apply the template, you will see a pop-up on the screen as the configuration process begins. While the reader is being configured, the LED will start blinking on the reader, as you can see on the screen. Once the configuration is completed, Let's test the card on the device. As you can see, the card is able to read the mobile vertical cards through the NFC or Bluetooth. That's it. You have successfully created a new template and applied it to your reader. And that's a wrap for this tutorial on how to configure your HID reader using HID Reader Manager mobile application. I hope you found this video helpful and that it will make the configuration process much easier for you. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more helpful tutorials like this one. If you have any questions or suggestions for future videos, please leave them in the comments below. We love hearing from our viewers. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.